Okay, guys. Let's start. Let's start. Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Golden J. Welcome back to another episode on the Golden SP server. This will be our first double digit episode on any SP that I've ever been on. I've never gotten to episode 10 on Sky Wars, on freaking survival games, on any SP of uh, the former SPs. I've never gotten 10 episodes on, so this is a very, very exciting step of stone for me. And but yeah, the reason why I'm on my computer right now is because it's Thanksgiving break, it's a Monday, and my mom's letting me get on my computer, which is freaking awesome, that stuff to do work, but you know, it, it, I get on my computer, which is really good, so I can record, I can edit, I can upload, etc, 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 and if you, any of you guys want to join Golden S&P, along with a bunch of awesome people, uh, just click on the link in the description of this video, it'll be there, it'll be like, apply to go to SCP now, and it'll be a link, you click the link, you apply, I look at it, and if your channel's good enough, if you're good enough, then you'll be able to join SCP, but without further ado guys, let's get into the video. So as you can see here, we got four little corners marked out, um, if you ever, if you guys ever watched my brass SMP episodes, I actually made an awesome, amazing uh, wheat farm, automatic wheat farm, just like this, and we're doing the same thing, but it's going to be bigger. Uh, so that right there, that's a 20 by 20 area. That's going to be for carrots. The one in Brash S&P was 18 by 18 and it generated a lot of wheat. So this is just two blocks bigger, but it's still better because, you know, it's two blocks bigger. And we have 40. So that one right there is going to be, um, that one's going to be, uh, what did I just say? That one's going to be carrots. This one right here is going to be potatoes. This one right here is going to be wheat. And that one right there is going to be the entire storage room. But yeah. That one right there is going to be the storage room, so we're all going to hook them all up into that room right there. But for this episode, we're going to be making this right there, and we're also going to be checking on our profits inside of the um, our shop. So, just a little thing that happened with the SMP. Uh, once 1.11 came out for Minecraft, I have the SMP jar set on default, and for it to be on default, that means that it's going to be running the most recent version of Minecraft for the SMP and most plugins don't work with 1.11 so the server updated the 1.11 I didn't want it to it just did it on its own because I had the jar set the default so it updated 1.11 most plugins didn't work so I had to change the jar to spig out 1.10 so the plugins work when I did that um all of the loaded chests in the world had got wiped clean like everything was gone inside of every single chest all the signs was gone so spawn was pretty much effed up but at the moment, my shop was the only shop that was built, so all of the armor that we put inside of those shops got deleted, and I had to restock, so that's that. But uh, before I actually had to change the server stuff, we made about two stacks of diamonds and then some, which is really good. We made profit, and we're gonna see how much profit we have now, right after we're done building this. So basically, uh, in Brash SMP, I explained what's going on here and how it works and everything like that. And if you guys never watched Brash SP, I guess I can explain it again. It's not really that hard. Uh, basically, what's happening, we have levels of the farm. First level is going to be this minecart mine cart system. So basically, in a minecart, we'll come here. It'll uh, load up the chest with whatever it collects. And then it'll get some on its way automatically. It'll go around. It'll go all the way around, picking up every single item that gets dropped. Come back to this center point right here. It'll go wee and do it all over again this is the first level the minecart level is the first level the second level is the dirt level which is right here so I'm gonna place a block here it's gonna be dirt and it's gonna go all across here and I put these blocks here because this is gonna be water basically so yeah I might replace it with glowstone so it can do light and be water at the same time but um that's that and the villager is gonna be on top of the dirt it's gonna be he's gonna be breaking the carrots and the carrots are going to drop on the floor and the minecart is going to come around, pick up the carrots and bring it back, which makes it automatic. So basically, we're going to be finishing this today and hopefully it could go by really smooth so we can start looking at, dang it, I didn't mean to break that. So we can start looking at our shop and everything like that. Alrighty guys, I'm done and basically what I just did is make this small little uh, machine here. So the minecart will come along right there, stop right here. If it has items in it, It'll, um, the comparator down here will pick it up and stop the 
Let me see, stop this torch. And then I'll turn that off, which will turn that off. And then the items will fall into that uh, chest right there. And when it's done with items, the comparator go off, turn everything back on, and it will be on its way. So now what I need to do is get some glowstone and just replace those things right there with glowstone. And try to see if I can find a better pattern for this, because this just looks ugly. Uh, Alrighty guys, I am back. It's 5 o'clock, and I've been away for like like five or so hours it, it took a long time to get this this mother sucker done but uh we have 33 levels so we're gonna go up top here and we're going to enchant and then i will show you guys the amazing awesomeness that i'm done with uh, originally it was gonna be a carrot farm but for a carrot farm you need the the villager to actually uh need to throw the carrots at something and then that farm wasn't meant for that so instead that's awesome so instead uh, I actually made a wheat farm saturation three let's go baby instead I made a wheat farm and this wheat farm is freaking awesome I mean it's awesome oh my god it's speed three so that's that's our wheat farm over there oh, I have speed three look at this <laughs> so this is our wheat farm he's in the middle he's gonna be cropping cropping the wheat and then we can come over here and then get what we need we don't have we have we have three sacks of seeds this is good I guess. but yeah we have three sacks of seeds which is all right oh my gosh this feels so different the speed three gives you speed but like when you have this on and actually get speed three it looks so much different and it feels so much better, but whatever. I'm gonna be using these because these actually, we can actually go faster with these, which is freaking awesome. But yeah, uh, we're done with the wheat farm. He's gonna be going, he's doing his thing. There's an enderman in there. Did I look at him? I'm not even sure. But yeah, he's gonna do his thing. And we're actually gonna go out and do some, um, come into this car. We're gonna go do some infernal mob hunting with a few other people and I'll make sure to record it and put it in this video so uh yeah let's just uh let's do that a fall uh, or a fail <laughs> i can't speak english okay guys no solely look in look in chat guys i'm a chicken no i have i have a guardian head at my house okay guys let's start Hello, everybody. Inferno mob hunting, let's go! Oh my god. <laughs> Woo! I I, I, of course you look like a chicken. 